Okay guys, it's me Imad from Nelson Darwin Plant Yard YouTube channel. So today you can see that we have a big mother plant of Echinopsis camacidus which is commonly called as the peanut cactus and we have a lot of cuttings you can see that which are protruding out from the main stem. You can see three babies also on one stem and now we need to cut all the stems which are extra elongated now you need to take the knife okay as it is a bit like a thorn thorny like so you need to uh, hold it with the forcep or direct cut it from what's called as the scissor okay so this is your stem this is your first stem okay now this is second one we are now going to cut it out and you can see that it is very delicate okay it is not like the other cactuses so now we need to okay now it's this okay and this process also leads to more baby production from where we make it wounded it will create a lot of babies on that part okay now we need to cut also the other one now this one cut it out okay now this one and cut it out okay now also this one so so we have cut it out all our stems you can see now we need to wait for them to dry because just putting as it is is a bit uh, dangerous because they can rot okay now now over after five days our cuttings are totally dried up and now we also have taken some compost uh, because I don't have some sand and uh, garden soil simple garden soil at that moment so I just uh, have taken the compost so now we, we, we just have taken four of our cuttings and now they are a bit black okay but but no need to worry about the cuttings temperature is like uh, 21.7 okay temperature is not so much like uh, it's not so much hot now we will make some hole in order to insert our cuttings in it now take cutting and just place it like this as the media is very delicate you can see that this compost is just made up of leaves so it is very very delicate stem will not find any sort of difficulty in producing roots now this one also this one okay okay we also need to put our stem in it like this and fourth one like this okay now insert it out make a hole and put it in it although they can survive without media for uh, some weeks as well okay now we will wait for results now after 35 days 
now our temperature has increased to 33.2 and now we can see that uh, our compost color has also a bit changed now and now we will remove the cutting out of our media and now you can see that how much rooting has been developed it also holds some sort of media because roots are a bit fibrous so what about the second one we will also see it now you can see that oh yes it's a uh, root is totally yeah totally intermixed with the media okay so now we will move it out yes now this is the root bowl of this cutting okay yeah 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 now you can see the roots as well properly okay so now this is our third cutting yes shooting has also developed yes uh, roots are a very very fibrous okay so so they can uh, like uh, intermix with the media this is the third result and these are our results so thanks for visiting our channel and stay tuned